Cedric Poor is accused in the deaths of four women at the Fairmont Terrace apartment complex. His brother James was convicted of that crime earlier this year. Jules, what the hell? Mom, I could have killed you. Not with that grip, you wouldn't. Please tell me these things usually get a better turnout. Sometimes. Tonight, not so much. Well, speak for yourselves, ladies. I'm going in. <clears throat> Pretty sure that's illegal. Well, only in 17 states. I'll go if you go. Zach, I am so glad to see you. You have to come meet my friends. I have told them all about you. Mom, Rosalie, you scared me. When did you get home? Oh, sorry. Sorry. Oh my God, Jules. Is she breathing? Help! She's having an allergic reaction! Are you kidding me? No, you cannot do this to me. I won't let you. I thought you said you hadn't been here before. Oh, I haven't. Aren't these your kids? Is that a threat? You're damn right it is. 29-year-old Elijah Henderson killed Carrie McCaw, her daughter Casey, and Leslie Prather and her daughter Ryan. Anthony Kirkland killed 13-year-old Esme Kenny while she was on a run by herself. He left her burned body in a wooded area. Kirkland murdered Mary Jo Newton. He pled guilty. They arrested Brian Williams in the death of 67-year-old Melody Gambetti. She had been decapitated and dismembered. Police say Cavandre Presley accused of killing Patricia Eifert at her daughter's new home. Christopher Terrell Anderson as the suspect. Police found Hannah Miller's 26-year-old's body lying on a highway with a gunshot wound. Jeremy Monty was charged with first-degree intentional homicide. Callie Elliott's family says she was killed in an act of domestic violence.